So we're back in the cabin now. Uh, just got changed, getting ready for supper. It's about six, six o'clock roughly. Uh, so we're gonna go see a cabaret show, I believe, or acrobatic show in the um, in the club. Six thirty. Uh, we're gonna sneak in dinner between. After, or sorry, we're gonna sneak in dinner after the club. That's no, right over. So anyway, hopefully we'll have some information. So anyway, we'll hope we'll have some. So, hopefully the plan, uh, hopefully, well that's not right either, what can I say? So tomorrow's a sea day and, uh, so tomorrow's a sea day so we have no plans, we'll see how that goes and stay tuned for more information on that. We'll see you soon. Have a good day. No, that's not good. Anyway, we're going out and we're going to have a good night. Nice dinner, nice entertainment. That's what it's all about. That's what I do. No. So tomorrow's a sea day. Uh, oh. So <clears throat> hopefully that all goes well in, in the right order and uh, we'll have some you on it maybe, who knows, but it's been a very good day here at uh, sea because we didn't really leave the ship, right? Again, it's uh, about 2.30 in the afternoon, sitting here in Nassau still. Uh, got off the ship for a little walkabout, but just walked up, took a couple of pictures of a couple of carnival ships and uh, Royal Caribbean, another celebrity ship here, and walked back. That was it. A lot of construction down on the pier in Nassau, so uh, it doesn't look so appealing to walk off unless you really know where you're going, I think. Just had a nice lunch, a uh, nice salad. Jane's gone to see if it's anything else at the buffet that might entice us uh, had a, having a nice beer and just sitting uh, on a lounge chair having a, a quiet day recovering from last night basically and good time to read a book have some lunch have a beer try to relax and take it in beautiful day though it's turned out really nice the people that did get off I'm sure they had a good time at the Blue Lagoon or the beach or wherever they went over to uh, Atlantis Paradise Island looks really pretty from here. We're gonna be here again uh, on the next cruise, so we may get off then, but today it was good. We just had a relaxing day. Got is pizza. It's a little bit of Greek thing going on there. There's a celebrity millennium next door. Has anybody ever seen these balconies before? This looks like it's been upgraded. Those have hot tubs. Do you see that? Hot tubs. Nice. We actually had a room at the back there with all those huge balconies once. We had like the corner. Yeah. That was nice. Uh, it was a one time deal only though. Never saw them again. Uh, we should be leaving because uh, all back on board was 2 30 anyway. So we should be leaving any second now.
So it's an update, we just uh, left NASA right back there. And we're heading now to, I think, a day at sea, and then we'll be in Belize, I believe. And sitting here with Jane. As we sail away, beautiful day, right, love? Yes. Didn't do much today. I think that's the kind of day we needed, right? Just a relaxing day. I'm really out of words today. <laughs> Q&A with Jane. We'll call this Q&A with Jane. Great. All right, how's that sound? Zoom out a bit. Well, maybe it won't zoom in as close yeah. for you. Maybe you probably like that. Okay, with NASA in the background. Oh, over there, there's the wake. Jane, what do you think of the ship so far? It's beautiful. What do you like about it best? <laughs> it's so clean, it's very pretty, it's just gorgeous. What do you think of our infinite veranda balcony? my favorite. I wouldn't get it again if I could help it. I like a regular balcony better. Um, but it's not horrible either. It makes the room nice and bright and dark at night too or in the morning. Yes, the, shade the big is, sheet that comes down makes it really dark. Yeah, yeah, I was really surprised at that. But you can't just peek up, you can't just peek out the window to see what it looks like outside. You gotta yeah. push that shade up, all the, like roll it up all the way from the bottom. Right. A little annoying. Mm -hmm. And the doors, what do you think they have those bifold doors that are frosted? Mm -hmm. a little, I mean, it's nice for a diffuse light, it looks pretty, but mm -hmm. yeah. it doesn't. It's not the same, you don't have the same feeling no. as a balcony. But the I mean, room is I mean, very the, pretty. It's first, very world, nice. first world complaints, right? Yeah. I mean, yeah. We're, on, we're on a cruise, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And they, they do have a lot of these nice outside areas like we are right now, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The magic carpet is really nice. I was surprised at that. You yeah. thought it might be more gimmicky. Yeah, I didn't realize you could like sit out there as much as you can. I thought it was only going to be for certain functions kind of thing. Right. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Oh. Like dining, you mean? Yeah. Private functions? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Didn't know that. All right. Anything else to comment or no, any comments? So far. Any concerns? You have any concerns? No concerns. So how about the food? What do you think of the food so far? Food is good. Main dining room last night? It was okay. Yeah. It was, it was okay. It wasn't extraordinary, was it? Yeah. And but for, for lots of times I find first night that happens, all right? Mm -hmm. I don't know why. The, our, our server seemed a little. Hmm, let's say. Let's say I think she was looking forward to the end of her contract, which apparently is coming up very shortly. <laughs> Didn't she say she's been here since August? Yeah, I think yeah so. so I think she's maybe a little tired. And it was first night for her. That's a bad, that, those are, are very rushed days, embarkation days, so for the staff. But it's nice that it wasn't a huge dining room. Yeah, the, the four little dining rooms are nice. Yeah, that's yeah. kind of a neat idea. Yeah. Yeah, you don't feel like you're in a main, main dining. And it, I mean, it's not a busy time now. No. And it wasn't busy. Right. Which was nice. Yeah. For now, maybe maybe we'll do this every day. We'll have a oh, sit yeah. down in the back and have a chit chat with Jane, a Q and A with Jane, questions and answers. That's what Q and A stands for. Very exciting. No. Wouldn't that be exciting? Yeah. We'll have to write actual questions down. This is kind of impromptu, wasn't it? We'll do it again. Okay. So Jane, Jane, see at sea. <laughs> says goodbye. Question period with Jane C at sea. At sea. Actual, actual C out there. What's what's your question, Jane? What do you have for me? Well, what's your take on the ship? What's my take on the ship? Mm -hmm. uh, in a general, all all around. When we first walked on, I thought it's a beautiful ship. looks looks really pretty when you walk on. I was I would say it's a very beautiful ship. Yeah, that's my take so far. Did you put your finger in front of the lens? Yeah. Another question. Favorite area of the ship so far? I would say also I like the magic carpet so far. Mm -hmm. Just feels like you're hanging over the edge. Even though it's the apex, still hanging over the edge. Mm -hmm.
and that feels it does feel nice out there. The seats could be a little more comfortable, I think. They're, they have some weird seating on the ship. Some weird seats. I think they made seats for like really large, six, seven foot tall people. Because the chair backs are so far back in some of those seats. You must have really long legs to sit there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that'd be my favorite spot. The solarium's nice. It's very open. What else? Give me something else. Give me what you got. Fire away. You have another question for me? No. Nope. No? That's, That's it? it? No, Alright. We covered everything so We didn't cover everything, but we'll, we'll save some questions for tomorrow. Because we haven't done much. We'll do that. We'll actually, you write down, tomorrow you write down three questions and I'll write down three questions. And then we'll do three questions each every day for 13 more days. How's that sound? Sounds terrible. Okay, we're going to do it. Well, we might not do it. If we don't do it, you won't see it anyway, so what does it matter? Okay. That's enough. So it's about six o'clock and I'm out here on the infant veranda balcony with actually the window open as you can see and it's actually quite nice nice uh, nice breeze coming in right now it's nice and cool not too not too humid feels good so we're gonna go out tonight and uh, see a show called caravan it's at the club I think it's a acrobatic type show I'm not sure and then we'll go for some supper uh, and then we'll go over to the main theater to see a show called The Tree of Life. Uh, hopefully that's good too. And uh, we might make it an early night tonight, since it was a late night last night. And hopefully enjoy a nice day at sea tomorrow. Here's a view of the ocean, and until then, we'll talk to you later. So we went down to the club to see the uh, caravan show and it's been cancelled for the night. They didn't say a reason why. I know a lot of entertainment has been cancelled because sometimes uh, some of the performers are in isolation or quarantine. Um, that could be the case or maybe, I'm not sure why. But anyway, we uh, found a, a nice spot here back in Eden, having a nice couple of unique cocktails. I listened to a really good guitar player down there. But it's super, super nice venue down here, right? Mm, yeah, yeah, it's very different. Yeah, it's different and relaxing and it's not crowded. We're up here on this third, maybe fourth level, I'm not even sure. And there, there's nobody here on this level. And there's even more levels over there. We're gonna go for supper and then we're gonna to try to see the show The Tree of Life, I think it's called. Cypress restaurant. And these are the exclusive parts you get in the Cypress restaurant. Exclusive features. Yeah, I know. It's classic, that's in every restaurant. And the signatures are also in every restaurant. We get a table in the corner all by ourselves. Social distance at its finest.